Hi everyone, this is Lisa. This is my first attempt to do a process video. Um, I can't get my camera exactly where I want it to go, but I'm going to have to do it at this angle until I figure something out. Out. Um, I'm hoping to order a just in order a tripod. And as you know, my cat's always a pain, so she's already nudging the camera. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to have to do mine in real life um, process because um, I don't know how to edit and I don't know how to, um, you know, fast forward or do anything like that. So I'm just recording it. Um, I'm hoping to keep it down like to a half hour. I am preparing things ahead of time. I watch a lot of the Katie Scott videos and she does it all just, you know, as she goes along. But I'm going to try to lay mine out to to get you know a pod you know to cut down the time so what i did is i i did some misting actually this is a uh, gesso with some yellow ink that i did and a stencil that i did have here somewhere but it might be over there cleaning some it's a studio calico stencil i did it with a gesso and um I grab this paper pad. I'm gonna. I pull some papers out that I like. I pulled out some arrows I like. I might use um, these from the uh, uh, Dear Lizzie collection uh, that I have. These I think are Dear Lizzie frames that came in a Studio Cal Studio Calico kit, and I pulled out a couple of those frames that I like. Um, these are the pictures. They're pictures of my daughters this summer on our camping trip, both wearing these goofy sunglasses. Um, so I did keep an extra white piece of paper out just in case I decide I do not like this um, this page. I kind of decided I liked this better than this. So I don't know. Um, I guess my thought was I was going to put a little frame around this, but I'm going to cut first, I think, this paper. This paper is from the Maggie Holmes collection. Um, I'm trying to make sure I feel a little bit better about writing things down. I was thinking something like this, maybe a little shorter. I'm not sure if that gesso is still wet. One thing, I, I just kind of started playing with gesso. I can say I really like it, and it does um, it does dry pretty fast. Like, if it's, like, thick like this, can you see this? If it's thick like this, it does take a little bit longer. Um, but if it's, you know, light, it, it does go really, really, it, it goes really, um, it dries really quick. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm a little bit nervous about doing this. Um, I actually have my seven-year-old daughter down here, who should be in bed, but she was homesick all day, and um, so she slept a lot, so she's not tired. And she's down here kind of watching the video because I can't see what's in the frame, so she's kind of helping me and guiding me. Um, so I'm going to put this little frame on this one. And um, she's making sure I'm, I'm not getting in the frame because I'm pretty sure I'm like, I don't want my body in the frame. And if you do see my body and see my shirt, you'll see that it's um, a Syracuse orange basketball shirt. I don't know how many people out there follow the uh, basketball, uh, college basketball, but um, my family is like really, really huge into it, and it's Sir Syracuse is our team. My family is quite serious Syracuse fans, but um, whoop, that's still a little damp. So um, they're going to be playing Thursday the tournament. So we're hoping they do something <clears throat> go far. Um, let me see. I had some ideas earlier and then I kind of was laying things out. I think I wanted to do this. I was trying to figure out how I wanted these. Like that. Like that. Maybe 
separate the yellow and Um, I kind of did this as a thought that um, that maybe it would be like, you know, looking a little sunshine, like hello summer. Um, I think this is our first camping trip this year. Could have been our, no, that was it. Could have been our last two because we sold our camper, but you know, we went camping one other time after that. <coughs> Okay, usually I'm pretty good at, a lot of times I just go with things and I don't like overthink it and I just lay down, but other times I'm not as decisive. Um, that's my cat over there going crazy. She, um, as you know, is a naughty girl. Um, so I'm thinking I don't like this and I am going to... Oh, my cat just attacked, <clears throat> and um, yeah, she's naughty. I'm going to go ahead and do this right down here. I probably should do some kind of outlining. I probably will. Um, actually, I'll do that before. Now I can see why it takes people so long to do these. But we're going to give it a shot. We're going to give it a shot. Why not? Um, I am down in my new scrapbook space that I've been saying I'm going to do a tour. Um, but I'm still not done with everything. I, I just want to be completely done before I do it. I want, I need, like I said, a light fixture. I need a few things. And, um, I'm going away to, for uh, the weekend, next weekend, and I'm doing a Monday, or Monday, yeah, a Thursday through uh, Sunday weekend crop with my sister. So um, with that going on, and just I've spent so much money in my room already, I kind of have to like cut back on what I'm spending on my room. So. Um, I need a few things, but it's going to have to wait. <laughs> oh, I'm sure I'm not the only person that has to wait and save their money. I, um, sometimes I travel for my job and I, uh, and I get mileage checks. And so, like, that's what I do. I'll say that. Like, I just got one in the mail tonight. So, that I'm saving for my light fixture. Because my light fixture is quite expensive. The one I picked out, of course, is the most expensive one that they carry. Um, cause that's just my style. I always like the most expensive. It's kind of a joke. It was a joke when my mom was alive too. My mom would say the same thing. If there was three sh shirts there and I, and I had to pick out one I liked, it would always be the most expensive one. I don't know how that happened. Now I think my daughter has that. Um, hey Chas. Is there a white doily underneath there you can grab me? I had a white doily underneath there. Could come handy having someone in here while I'm doing a video. It might be under the basketball brackets. I had some stuff laid out, like I said, but I don't know. Maybe not, honey. It's a big white doily. But I'm kind of liking this so far. Um, I kind of would like a different, um, or a little bit more of a contrast. No, it's okay. I have more doilies up here, I guess, I could use. Am I in the video chest? <laughs> Was I? <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> I definitely don't want a video. I'm the last person in the world who's ever wanted to be in a video. Um, it's definitely not me. <laughs> oh, that's okay, baby girl. Mommy will use something else. Okay, so I'm kind of liking this. I just can't decide. I definitely didn't want the yellow on the yellow, so I needed something here. I think it's her yellow, but I didn't know if I... Hmm. I don't know. I'm having a hard time layering. That's not like me. So I, what I think I need to do is make a decision about this and go with it. That's what I usually do. Um, let's see. 
Yeah, so anyways, about basketball. <laughs> basketball is like our life, um, which is so strange because I never played basketball. My brothers, I had three brothers, they never played basketball. Um, but um, my nephew played for a while, and my oldest daughter, Chloe, plays. And, um, and she just started playing like in the last, I think this is her third year her third year and um, I guess I never thought I'd be a basketball mom. Then she started soccer two years ago. Even though she never played those before, she always just played softball and and that was about it. That's what she loved. But um, she decided to get into them. So now I'm a soccer mom, basketball mom, and a um, softball. Softball, soccer, basketball. But um, like I said, my family always has loved the Syracuse Orange um, basketball. So um, it seems like between my daughter playing basketball and um, yeah. the Syracuse basketball, that's all we do. Because my daughter, not only does she play on the school team, she decided to do a travel team this year. So even after our season was finally done, we still were going nonstop with. Um, with the basketball. So, yeah. So, anyways, if you guys want to, you can root for Syracuse. Um, even my mom who passed away was a huge Syracuse fan. My grandfather. It's a family event. We get together every single game that we possibly can because obviously someone, we have to work or they're a different time of the day, but we get together and we try to watch um, <clears throat> the games together as a family with my brothers and everything. So it's kind of funny because my poor daughter, she like goes to basketball practice so Monday through Friday, Sunday she does softball practice, and tonight she just got home from softball practice. And my youngest daughter, she does um, soccer and she does um, ice skating. So she just had her ice skating show last weekend and my daughter had her last basketball game. So it was kind of nice because um, we were done with everything but we're already back into softball practice. So anyways, enough about that. Um, I just misted this doily. That's what I've been doing a lot. If I want them to kind of match something, I just use my miss and I've been just, you know, getting them to the color I like and um, it takes the ink they take the ink very well it, I wasn't sure how they would take it but they take it very very well um, you know as long as you let them dry but even that you can see I did that in my pretty quick that I might have waited a little bit longer but um, I think I'm gonna do something like hello summer Something like that. I'm trying to get my 2013 album done um, before we go into the summer of 2014. But I do have every photo printed and laid out ready to go um, so that I know. I even have some of the paper picked out so that I know, you know, what needs to be done. And, you know, I'm kind of going in order. I just open it. I have it all laid out in my album already and all I do is just turn the page. Okay, this is what needs to be done next. Um, I'm hoping having a three-day weekend um, scrapbooking, I'll be able to get a lot of pages done. Alright, so so far this is what I have. I'm going to put something here to cover that because I really don't like that thing. Um, I think this might be just the wrong kind of blue. Um, I just watched a video on YouTube today. It's about frugal scrapbooker or something like that. That lady had so much scrapbooking stuff that it just blew me. 
Oh. Uh, is it still okay? Sorry about that. My daughter touched the video. Um, but it blew me away in the amount of stuff that she has. I mean, she does a lot of crafts. Like, different crafts. She does, like, beading and all sorts of things. Um, but it's quite if you ask me. So I'm thinking to myself, oh my gosh, I'm going to be doing a video share. I look like I have nothing, nothing compared to these people. And I, and I don't. I mean, really, I feel like I have plenty and I don't feel like I need more. I really don't because I think I said this before in one of my videos. I tend to like what's new, the latest and greatest kind of thing. Um, hold on one second. I just wanted to this was the color blue and it wasn't exactly so I just took my um, Heidi Swap um, mint and just inked over it to give it kind of the look that I what I liked um, so anyways like la last year someone new was starting scrapbooking and I went through and I know I bought a trunk full of stuff to them to give um, to someone someone and then um, as I move my scrapbooking stuff if I have not used it in like the last year I I got rid of it um, I had a friend come over her and her granddaughter just started scrapbooking and, and I had her come and take a ton of stuff away um, everything just and I'm really I'm down to stuff that I use and it's I have it looked like I had so much more stuff in my scrapbooking room people used to joke and call it a little store um, but it was stuff that I didn't use so what's the point you know but obviously my friends have not seen these YouTube videos because holy man people have a lot of stuff I think I watched I can never say her name Wilma Ferguson for no not for it's not that easy um, she, she shows a video of her stuff and she says, you know, like she doesn't have that much stuff and she, she has a lot, but she claims you don't need that much stuff. And so I'm sticking with her, her point of view. Um, so I'm going to use these stickers. They are from what? They just say puppy stickers. They don't say. I was thinking hello summer. I'm not sure if I want to do all the way down here. Is that noise Is that the cap? Oh, it looks like I have oh. Well, I guess I should start backwards. <clears throat> um, I watch a lot of Nicole Jones videos. Um, I love watching her videos. Uh, um, And they make it look so easy. Actually, I think the person who makes it look the easiest um, is, if you guys haven't ever watched, she's, oh, why can't I think of it? Not Jen Gallagher. Is it Jen Gallagher? Yeah, Jen Gallagher. Oh my gosh. I love her style. I love, her style is definitely kind of what I would say my style could be like. Or is what, well, maybe not. But I like her style. It's clean cut. I, and um, she makes it look so easy. You know, you ever see those scrapbookers that make it like just look easy? And <laughs> you wonder, like, you know, how they do that. Sometimes I can spend hours on a page. I think in Hello Summer, I'm not sure if I love these down here or not, but I might just go with it. Um, I'm thinking maybe I should outline the whole white, which I'm hoping I don't regret. Uh, who does this? Um, Tara? Uh, what's her face? Oh, what's her, what's her face? What's her name? Um, it'll come to me. She is one of my favorites, and she hasn't been posting that much, but I love watching her. I like watching hers. Hers And her pages all seem different. Like, I mean, you, you kind of get everyone's style and how they do. Um, 
just how they do you know, honey honey stay with my video and you know their style or whatever uh, Tracy Tracy's her name um, but I think Tracy does different things I, I really like that I like that she's different and changes it up um, I know I need more embellishments I just don't know what my first set of flares ever um, hmm I could maybe do that simple things that's right in that color maybe here on oh, this side <laughs> sometimes I get my embellishments out one thing I noticed when I was like organizing my desk the hardest part is I want everything right at right at in reach let me finish my words I have a hard time finishing my sentences. I know it's that in a lot of my videos, I never finish my sentences. But I um, just go through some of my brass. I'm going to just cut and paste. Um, I tend to never finish my words, my sentences, and uh, I skip over to another word. It just seems like this would probably just be a very... Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. Let's see. These are cute. Those stickers. It says practically perfect in every way. Oh, it might be too much yellow. I might have to tie some more blue in here. I'm not sure if I'm liking this. As you can see, I make a mess when I'm doing this. Let's see. I think I might want some more blue under here just to give it. Oh, I have washi tape somewhere. I could probably turn in some washi tape. I have been using washi tape as much as I used to. Kind of like that, but I worry about this edge being too, you know, nothing there. I don't think I want to go there with that because. Well, I guess it could be my triangle. <laughs> hmm. Chess, will you give open my washi tape and put it over there so mommy can get the washi tape, please? Hey. Washi tape. Hey. Just open it and lay it open there. I need some bluish green. Oh, how's the video doing? How many minutes am I at, baby? Twenty. 23, oh my goodness, I better get rocking and rolling. Uh, let me see. I'm thinking I'm going to regret putting these down here. I think it, I might do some washi tape down here or this down here. I'm going to do some here. I don't know. Okay. Hit me some blue greens, please. Greens? Greenish blue. I think I want that up here. It's too far down. Say hi, kitty. Just hand me any blue, green, blue, turquoise. Turquoise. Here, pass it right over here. Yep, perfect. That's like exactly what I'm looking for. I guess I just had to say the right color. This kitty is a pain, as you guys all know when you see my videos. She knows no boundaries. No. And like I said, I've been home all day today with my daughter who's been sick. Um, I was supposed to work today, but I'm work tomorrow instead. And she just can't leave me alone. She just torments me. Um, has to be where I am every second. I'm trying to fill up some paperwork. She's right there. I'm trying to, you know, scrapbook. She's right there. I can't do anything without her. Oh, it's tearing out my paper. It stinks. Oh well. I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm okay with that. I'm gonna go cover that with some cool. I think that's good, honey. I don't need more washing tape, please. Um so yeah.